Here in DaVinci Resolve, we're going to have a look at how we add our highlights. This is useful if you're doing a tutorial or instructional video and you want to basically highlight an area of what's on screen or of something you've recorded in your video. So we're going to delete what we have set up here already and we are going to come up to the top left and turn on our effects panel. And once that's turned on, we are looking for the titles panel, which is in the toolbox. And we are looking for the basic title. So we'll scroll up here. We're looking for this basic text. We'll drag this down to the timeline. And the text is white, so we can't quite see it. And we're not really going to use the text. We're mostly going to use the outline for this box. So if we double click on our text box on the timeline, then we're going to remove the text that we have in the rich text box. And we'll scroll down. And what we're looking for is the background options. So in the background options, we're going to increase the height here. We're going to reduce the width. And we're going to position this over the top of this left hand image here. So we'll use the center option to move that. And I'm just dragging along here, either increasing or decreasing the offset. So we get that in about the right spot. And then we can modify the width so it kind of snaps around this nicely. So once that's in position, we're actually going to turn the opacity off of the center color or the fill color. And we're going to increase the outline width and then change the outline color by clicking on this box. And there you go. We have our highlight there that we can use and reuse. We can come and modify the width if we have different size objects. We want to highlight something different. We can change the corner radius. So it can be completely square or have a little bit of a curve on it. And then if we want to fade this in, so we'll just come down to the timeline. And we're going to use Control or Command T to add that transition to fade in that box. So it's super easy to add a highlight within DaVinci Resolve when you're doing any tutorials or that type of thing, and you need to highlight some of your instructional content in your video. If you do have any questions about this, then please do get in touch.